Hey friends, I don't know about you, but I have been on the internet way too much this past week. Um, I've just been reading as much as I can on the COVID-19. I've been following things on social media and on the news, and it's just a little bit overwhelming. One of the reasons I think we all are feeling stressed right now is the lack of certainty. The more I read on the internet, the more I feel as if I should be able to find answers, but we still don't have very many answers. One of the things we don't know is how long this is all going to last. Is this coronavirus situation going to last for uh, weeks or months? Is it going to drag on to the summer? Uh, a second thing we don't know is how severe it's going to be. Are, are many people going to contract the disease? Are many deaths going to be caused? We just don't know. Um, we don't know how long so many people are going to be out of work. There are lots of financial and economic uncertainties that we're all facing. And, and the more that I read about all these things, the less answers I have. And this can cause a lot of anxiety. So I don't know if you find yourself stressed right now. I find the more that I'm on the internet reading stuff, the more I have anxiety, the more I'm worried about these things. So how do we stop this cycle? Let me... Let me give you just one suggestion. Jesus, when he taught us to pray, told us to pray to the Father, and he said this, give us this day our daily bread. Give, us what, give, give me, Lord God, give me what I need for today. Provide for my immediate need. Can we trust God for today? What I want is more than just today. I want God to meet all of my needs indefinitely. I want God to give me not just my daily bread, but enough bread stockpiled for months and years to come. I would pray for unending supplies of food and toilet paper, right? This is why we hoard things, because we don't trust for what we need today. But Jesus knows that, that what we really need is to worry about what's in front of us, to do what we need today, to trust in God to provide for today. How about this? Uh, go for a walk. Take your family, go for a walk. This week, there's been a, a grace. It's been nicer this week in Minnesota, although it's gotten cold again. Every day early this week, we would just go out, just go for a walk, walk for an hour, just spend some time outside. Uh, maybe play a game tonight with your kids. Do simple things. Take your mind off of what all these things that we don't know and trust in God. And here's what I know. We, I, I don't know what's coming tomorrow. I don't know, um, I don't know how this is all going to end. Um, but there's a God who will provide your daily bread. Uh, look to him. Trust him in these days. And he will be with you. God bless you. Have a good week.